The superstar anxiously awaiting the arrival of their opponent. And oh, not even waiting for their opponent to get inside the ring. This just speaks to how much bad blood exists between these two. And the referee trying to restore some semblance of order, but the damage has been done. Well, clearly, the advantage goes to the one who initiated the attack. Well, thankfully, the official able to get things under control, and this superstar is going to go at it despite the attack. After a shotgun attack during the entrances, this match has found its way inside the ring at last. Now we can really get things started. I just cannot believe the referee is actually allowing this match to continue. Oh, Byron, these superstars are all adults, and the referee isn't there to play counselor. The referee's there to officiate this match. You don't have to like it, but this match is going to happen. That holds back Bossman's attack. Hilarious. Good Lord. That was nasty. Ah, uh, crank in the head. Oh, and Ali manages to counter. Oh, God, that hurt. Measured up nicely. Fist drop. Vicious right forearm. Big boss man takes on every opponent with such malicious intent. It's got to be hard to overcome those odds when big boss man is aiming for you. It's definitely not easy, but it's not impossible. Sometimes that rage will backfire on him. Big Boss Man's like a bull seeing red, Cole. His opponent just has to be the matador. And set right into the corner. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Dodged right on cue. Big Boss Man, he thinks he has it. Just kicks out. Not yet. Muhammad Ali is in big jeopardy here. Far off with an elbow. Lately, things have been a tad heated between these competitors. Yeah, this could develop into a pretty serious rivalry if it keeps escalating. Maybe they'll squash the beef here and now, and that'll be the end of it. Setting it up. Boom! Wheels are turning in Ali's head. Boom! Did you hear the impact? Ali can put it away here. Goes down. He's still in this fight. His opponent thought he had it in the bag for sure. This is when you have to switch game plans. You can't let yourself get discouraged. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that would end most matches. Talk about dismantling your opponent. He reverses it. Uh-oh, time to get dizzy. Take over, Byron. I'm going to be sick. That's the airplane fan. Does he get him here? Yes. Muhammad Ali with the win. celebrating tonight. None of these competitors were giving an inch in this one. A moment of pride here, beating the odds and coming out on top. I'm sure the whole WWE Universe is a little in shock right now.
The D'Angelo family is here in business. Very good. Tony and Stax take what they want. The only problem is they want it all. The following contest is a tag match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 472 pounds, the WWE Tag Team Champions, Tony D'Angelo and Channing Lorenzo, the D'Angelo family. The D'Angelo family surveying the scene, ready to make their move. Well, I have a feeling the opposition is going to be sleeping on the mat real soon. Better than sleeping with the fishes. The damn Dudleys at it again. Oh, baby, we are about to get extreme. And their opponents at a combined weight of 595 pounds. Bubba Ray and Devon, the Dudley Boys! You never know what's going to happen with the Dudleys, except that someone's going through a table. Yeah, we know the Dudleys have held tag titles everywhere they've gone, but they always have something up their sleeves. Bubba and Devon truly raise the bar for brutality. Every match with them quickly turns into a brawl. Get ready for a fight that would make Big Daddy Dudley proud. Here we go with one of the most malicious and innovative tag teams the WWE has ever seen, the Dudley Boys. A team synonymous with finding new and creative uses for furniture inside the ring, the Dudley Boys are all about causing chaos and destruction at the price of their opponent's well-being, and often their own, too. It's certainly not a style of competition that suits everyone, but for the Dudleys, risk-taking just comes naturally. And they're staring at WWE's resident wise guys, Tony D and Stax, the D'Angelo family. While they may have some questionable connections, the D'Angelo family has made it clear that they will do whatever they need to do to make it to the top of WWE, whether by hook or by crook. Oh, they dropped across the back of the neck. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. From the top, toppling down. He got whipped into that corner. Ooh. Ooh. On Stax fights back. This here is vintage. Snake eyes. Close line. He can end it here. Big kick out. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Flying forearm connects. Effectively using the knee. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Breaker. Ow. Oh, I hope they back up. They're, they're getting too close for comfort. Well, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. Oh, man. 
I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Dash just adding salt to the wound right now. Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, counts running out. Ooh. What a punch! And on that exchange, it looked like Devon lost some focus. That's the kind of physicality we can expect from Stax. Headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Into the corner now. Just what was needed to take advantage of the bigger opponent. Xplex man! And shoulders are down. Two! What? Oh, he kicked out. This could be a tipping point in this match. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Lots of emotions in the ring right now. There's a score to be settled here. I'm not so sure things can be settled in a single match where these superstars are concerned. Yeah, things have only gone from bad to worse between them. He gets tagged in. Sends him into the corner. Ooh, ho, ho. They finish each other's sentences. They finish each other's moves. That's tag team excellence right there, gentlemen. He saw it coming, taking advantage. How's that for a counter? I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Boom! What a right! Uh-oh. Devon gets intercepted. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Oh, counters right into the breadbasket. Placed into the corner. Oh, this here is vintage. Snake eyes. Uh oh, jawbreaker. Call the dentist. Oh. Solely focused on. Punishing the leg. Well, they tilt the world with sidewalk slam. Tag made, double team offense on the horizon. Up and down with Bobby. No doubt, D'Angelo ended this. He's been placed in the corner now. Devon creates an opening. Oh, an overhand punch. Oh, He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Look out! Look out below! And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. All the way down. He's returning fire. Holy, meet the barricade.
Bubba Ray telling his opponent to bring it. Both men now on the apron. This is a scary situation. Are you kidding me? Off the apron to the floor. Whoa, drop kick all the way to the outside. Oh, the end is looming now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. Smash, nothing fed. Oh my god! And it's reverse pain for that mistake. DDT! Cover! Shoulder up before the count started. Wow! Taking the easy way. Kick to the gut. And a big right hand. These men are looking battered and bruised. You have to believe the end is near. Bruised, but not broken. This one is going as long as there's breath in their lungs. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Oh, man. Shot right to the midsection. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Kick to the gut. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Look out. Oh, 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 oh. Right across the back of the neck. Ouch. He may get the three count right here. This is it. And he kicks out of the pin in one. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? Reaches his partner for the tag. And Tony didn't see that coming. Oh, be quiet, guys. What a chop. Oh, man. Shoulders down. Maybe not. Oh, my goodness. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh. Up on their shoulders, down in a hurry. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. And this is just a vulgar display of... Ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Oof. Oh. Oh, we're going to grind the features off their face across the top rope. He's struggling a bit here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? What a chop! Oh, man. And there was some force on that move. Look at Bubba Ray unleashing the jabs. And a Put that match in a museum or a textbook so future teams can study to learn this craft.
The Alpha Academy is here. Byron, I've always wanted to do this. Shoosh! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied by Akira Tazawa, representing the Alpha Academy from Phoenix, Arizona, Maxine Dupree! You know, Alpha Academy may look like a bunch of oddballs, but they're legit. I wouldn't be surprised if they're really an accredited academy. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly competitive. They certainly think so. I bet Alpha Academy is thinking that by the end of the night, we'll all be saying thank you. No, no, Saxton, like this. Uh, thank you. Oh, 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 good tip. Thank, Byron. Thank you, you, thank you. You just flunked out of the academy. J.C. Jane, a superstar with a rock star attitude. And her partner from Tampa, Florida, J.C. Jane. J.C. Jane only looks out for herself. In fact, she proved it by viciously betraying past allies. Not making any new friends around here. She thinks she's on a completely different level. Jane brings a certain fire to the ring every time she competes. And she has attitude to spare, ready to make her next big statement tonight. Here comes Michael Cole's favorite team in all of WWE, Damage Control. Oh, God. Don't let Bailey hear that, Corey. Bailey! Hey, over here! And accompanied by EO Sky, Bailey and Dakota Kai! Damage control! For anybody doubting Bailey's qualifications as a role model, look at what she has done with damage control. EO Sky, Dakota Kai, multiple time women's tag team champions. Look, there's no doubt Bailey has been a help for Dakota and EO, but she's also used them as shields and basically as backup to do her dirty work. Oh, relax, Saxton. They're simply giving their role model the respect she deserves. Dominance, thy name is Damage Control. A team that loves to wreak havoc within the women's locker room, both in and out of the ring. Damage Control is ready to compete here tonight. As talented and decorated as every woman in this team is, for some reason, all the accolades in the world still somehow aren't enough for them. They feel the need to rule the division with an iron fist. Any tactic they can think to gain control, they'll take. You can be sure of that. As this match gets underway, I should note that it's standing room only here in Sydney. Oh, hanging on for dear life. Into a powerbomb. And into the count. Tagging her partner in. It gets the tag. Dodge 
dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. And the manager is searching under the ring. She could only be looking for something nefarious down there. She's got thrown around like a sack of you know what. Reversal! What a counter! All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. Wiggles free. From behind. Chop block. What impact. Monster set up in the corner. Oh, wow, right to the face. Pick up your teeth in the front row. It's got to be demoralizing when you're the combatant on the wrong side of the double team. Maybe you want to rework the game plan about now. Big form. Oh. A heel hook. Locked in, you can almost hear the opponents yelling in agony. A lot of tension being used. What are we going to see here? Nice suplex. Shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Nice hip toss. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Shoulder tackle. Looking wobbly in the corner. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. That arm's gonna be sore for a while. Could affect all their offense. Maxine with a counter. Oh, sit out slam. Punch right to the face. This match is wearing her down. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. Tag made. What's in store here? Drop toe hold. Toe hold on the elbow on the back of the neck. Tandem offense in effect. A good team knows how to truly work as one. Precision right on target. One. Oh, and an elbow. Oh, stiff punch. Hey. Effective arm drag. And she's stunned in the corner. Just shifted. This is just establishing dominance, followed by a stomp. Tag made, she's in. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. There's the tag. Knee. Knocked with the point of the elbow. 
This is just establishing dominance. Oh, Ooh. what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Set up in the corner of the ring. Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. She scores big with the counter. Get back here. Leg Larian. Back out. Did you see that? this going to be? Oh, and Enziguri! She's able to make it! What a pump kick! Arm ringer, able to fight out with a punch in the face! She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Face watch. Oh, hanging off for dear life. Oh, that oh. Save. Oh, oh. Still got more fight here. She's looking for the win. Not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Stop it away. Ugh, I don't have you seeing stars. Double stop. That physical nature of James being met head on. For the victory here. No, she kicks out. She just won't stay down. To the corner. This can't be good. Uh -oh. That unraveled on JC. Oh, straight four. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Trying to target the back of the neck here. She's getting back to her feet, but is there fight left? Got the tag. Lock applied. Watch this agility. Into the arm drag. Look out! Suicide dive! Like a heat seeking missile hit the target right on the mark. Whoa. Quick back elbow detours that offense. Into the barricade. It's a matter of wills now, as these women have reached a pivotal point in this match. No inch has been given, no relenting in sight. Jane out of there in a hurry. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. Dakota Kai looking for a little real estate to work with. Here she comes. Oh. Boom! Face 
smash. Oh, hanging on for dear life. He she covers for the pin. And a victory here tonight. Here are your winners, Bailey and Dakota Kai. Damage control. A landmark victory for damage control here tonight. I don't know if anyone is happy with this win except for damage control. Maybe the best big match wrestler of all time, Shawn Michaels. the and impressive career defined by memorable and historic victories. A back-to-back -back Royal Rumble winner, the first ever Grand Slam champion, competed in the first ever ladder match. I hate to cut you off, Michael, but HBK's accolades could go on all night. He's a true inspiration, a shining light in this business.
And his partner, accompanied by Veer Mahan, representing Indus Shed from India, weighing in at 297 pounds. You are looking at some highly motivated competitors in this match, looking to steal the show and capture the attention of the entire WWE Universe. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. The LWO is in the building. It's time for everyone to stand up and take notice. And accompanied by Zelina Vega at a combined weight of 350 pounds, Joaquin Wilde. There's a lot of pride that comes with being a member of the LWO. Each and every one of these members are mighty proud of what they're a part of. And that pride translates into their top-level performance in the ring. The LWO in action here tonight, a tight-knit crew. This team is honestly more like a family. Each individual's success is considered a team success and vice versa. Yeah, there's a lot of pride among the members of the LWO. Just by virtue of being part of this collective, it's really refreshing to see. And as we'll no doubt see tonight, that pride is what drives them. As this match gets underway, I should note that it's standing room only here in Sydney. Oh, and it's for the DDT! Drop kick right to the knee. Aim on point, like a sniper taking out the knee. Oh, Rey Mysterio. Look at that power bomb. That power bomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Go right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, running Hurricane Rana. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Oh, what a strike to the back. Oh, man. He's looking a little off balance. Yeah, Wilde knocked him around in the style fitting of Legato Del Fantasma. Does the official not see him removing the turtle? He's a coward. coward. down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. Nice Ripped in the hard way. Just a 
perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. He turns it around. Vicious, downright savage club right there. And it looks like Ray's not the only one with a will to win. Yeah, and Sangha put that right on target. There's a lot of hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. Yikes, that'll either wake you up or knock you out. Boom, right across the small of the back. Unbelievable athleticism. <laughs> Into the armbar. Scrubs his way out. Left by the turnbuckles. Pinpointing the leg. Ooh, Payne must be shooting through that leg now. He's gearing up for something. Ring rattling. Saga is overwhelming his opponent here. Saga is being smart and not letting up. Able to get there in time. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. A running hurt Rana. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. Strikes with the back elbow. He's got him down. Is this it? Stops the count before a two. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. In the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Face first. Pinpointing the leg in the corner. Tendons and ligaments in the leg can be easily damaged by that. Reversal on Sangha. <laughs> Quickly, the cover! Just gets the shoulder up. That was a long two count there. Uh-oh. Oh, well scouted by Wilde. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Back and forth from these competitors. Oh, man. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, slingshot cross body. That was ridiculous. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear. Absolute reckless abandon. Grabbing a hold of the arm. And well-timed maneuver there. Uh-oh. Reigns down an elbow retaliation. Jawbreaker! On the dentist. Watch out. What a swinging neck breaker. The rep may call a count out soon, guys. You do not want to test this rep. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. That'll stop the count, and this match will continue. Don't do it! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off! Talk about a jumping nothing. A real miscalculation on their part. left in the tank. Oh, this has got to be demoralizing for Michaels. Yeah, but Michaels might just be waiting for an opportune time for a match-changing move. A running Hurricane Rana. Beautiful. Answering back. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. He is just reeling from that offense. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oh, my, a jumpy DDT. Absolutely planted. And he had Ray's number there. Quick exchange of counters there. Springboard misses the target. Incredible off 
Athleticism. For the win! The biggest little man in WWE history is standing tall. Defiant counter from HBK. Getting set up for something in the corner. Headlock applied a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Uh-oh. Mysterio with great evasion. Drop kick down low. Does he have him here? Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. How? How? Ah, look at this. Oh, the weakening arm breaker. Oh, my God, what a cross body. Climbing the turnbuckle now. Soaring. Oh, and he doesn't connect. Close to three. Mysterio. Boom, DDT. That's gotta be it. There's two. And the victory. Here are your winners. Joaquin Wild and Ray Mysterio. The LWO. The LWO with pride they just showed everyone what they're all about this is what the lwo does they feed out the energy of the wwe universe propelling them to great heights Ready for the matchup, very tough oh. hand from behind. Someone was a bit worried about this matchup. So much so, this competitor had to deliver a cheap shot. Well, that could create some disastrous repercussions for this competitor moving forward in this match. Because if you can't walk, you can't fight. And so there's the bell, but I don't know how much of a match we're in for after that sneaky assault that took place during the entrances. We'll just have to wait and see how that little scuffle alters the balance of power in this contest. Little scuffle? I think you're downplaying what we just saw unfold in front of us. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. T.O. Uh-oh. She avoids the attack completely. Oh, what a clothesline. Working to neutralize that arm. Oh, what a maneuver. Adding a little flair to a damage and impact. Quite the showmanship. An emphatic kick out, and there's still a lot of game left here. Well-framed standing moonsault. It's incredible, the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Over the course of her career, we've seen Molly Holly take home some impressive wins. Corey, how do you tackle a superstar of her caliber? Against the likes of Molly Holly, there are no shortcuts, Cole. She has power, she has talent, she has experience. 
So it's really going to take focus and some clever thinking to get the better of him in this one. You have to strategize and look for ways to outsmart her. She heads out, but this one can be lost by count out. Hair whip was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Oh, God, face first. Three. Molly taking a step back and measuring her opponent. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Rolling through into a kick. Oh, just throwing their body. Whoa. Ah, stops the legs, producing a trampling. <laughs> Reversal. Can she capitalize? Coquina clutch. Locked in. Counters. taking their lumps at this point. Their opponent is not messing around. Thea has taken full command here. Look at this clever offense. Trying to out... Snap mare right. Surfboard. She does break out of it, but has the damage been done? Hale able to counter. Finally, Thea is able to interrupt these attacks for a moment. Yeah, Thea's survival instincts are taking over. Ooh! Vicious knee. Arm ringer applied. Top wrist lock. Opponent down to one knee. But this opponent still fighting back. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Ooh -hoo. She's starting to tire a little. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. We all know what she's looking to do next. From the top! Oh, the Molly go down! That's it, Molly just ended things. Two count! Oh, she won this match, but... Doing some jaw jacking and wait. Oh no. Steel chair in hand. Talking okay, about why? a sore sport. Why? Why the steel chair? What? No, no, no. <laughs> Winning wasn't enough. Wants to make sure that this superstar never walks again. This is sickening. Ladies and gentlemen, when you think of WWE, you think of John Cena. 
Loved by many, resented by some, but respected by all. The following contest is a tag match set for one fall. Introducing first, from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, the WWE Champion, the greatest of all time, John Cena! John Cena is a man who's always practiced what he preached. He embodies never give up and hustle, loyalty, respect. Now, even his detractors have to admit Cena's dedication. He never gives anything less than his very best. From where I'm sitting, he is the greatest WWE superstar in history. His name is John Cena, a 16-time world champion. Yeah, now we're talking. And his partner, representing the Bloodline from Pacific Islands, weighing in at 209 pounds, Tama Tonga! The moment this match was announced, the WWE Universe has expected a classic. I think it is destined to deliver. A guy who treats every match as if it's the biggest one of his career. He definitely plans to steal the show tonight. With eyes full of wrath and fury, here comes Ilya Dragunov. And from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov! There are not many superstars more ferocious than Ilya Dragunov. Well, that ferocity, Saxton, has led Dragunov to the NXT UK Championship. Let's see if it brings him more success tonight. And called the czar of NXT. Right now, Ilya Dragunov looking to expand his power to all of WWE. Here comes a man with a vision. And from Benway State, Nigeria, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews! A former United States champion won the Intercontinental title at WrestleMania, but Cruz was still struggling to find himself. Yeah, but now that Cruz has found himself, all of WWE is on notice.
There's no telling what Cruz is capable of with this newfound focus. Well, if Cruz can truly unleash that untapped aggression we've seen under the surface, nobody's safe. And this tag team match is sure to be filled with exciting action. These teams want the win bad tonight, and they'll fight hard to get it. Yeah, these superstars look like they're all business, not a weak link among them. Big time power bomb. That was one of those power bombs that would shorten someone's career. Down with a sling blade. Basement drop kick. Elbow drop. Piercing. A little sizzle before the stake. Get into a clothesline. Cover! Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? And those kickouts are only going to get harder. Getting him into the corner. John Cena, wow, sunset flip power bomb. Now that's what you call impact. Hits him with the counter. Boom! Has him up for the power slam, and instead delivers the inverted DDT. Measured knee drop. That's going to leave a mark for sure. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Cena turning things around. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, man. Taking a few hard shots, and John Cena looked a bit threadbare. Kick to the stomach puts an end to that. Pulls their opponent in, belly to belly. Able to avoid any harm there. Hurricane. I'm still trying to figure out what we just saw. Netbox suplex. Able to reverse that one. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. into the corner. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. And he goes for the pin. And he powers out. Somehow, some way. He must have had that scout. Big boot. Vicious. Careful. Stop to the arm. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. That gets reversed on Apollo. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex. Uh-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. He went right into that turnbuckle. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. In off the tag. Look at this. 
fist just crank in the head. That's got to hurt. This could do it. An exhausting match, but a victory he'll savor forever. Here are your winners, John Cena and Tama Taka. An emphatic victory for your winners. An impressive effort from this duo. Gives you hope for the future of the tag division. Great tag team action on display, guys. Here comes the queen, Charlotte Flair. A woman who has truly done it all in WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from the Queen City, the Divas Champion, Charlotte Flair. Well, I just checked the weather here and the forecast calls for greatness. Charlotte Flair is one of the greatest female superstars of all time. In serious conversation, to be the GOAT. Yeah, look at all the record title reigns. Look at all the main events. Look at all the firsts. The history books were made for someone of Charlotte Flair's caliber. Whether you like it or not, no one can measure up to Charlotte Flair. She was bred for this business and has become the absolute pinnacle. She really is the biggest challenge there is in this women's division. From Dungeon to Diva to an all-time great. And from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia! A true powerhouse in the ring, a third-generation athlete, and wrestling royalty. Natalia possesses all of the weapons. She's held singles and tag team gold, and she has the most wins in women's division history. She's a three-time world record holder, and many more to come. Natalia has earned the right to refer to herself as the measuring stick of the women's division. You're right, Corey. Natalia is an all-time great here in WWE and seems to get better as time goes on. Charlotte Flair has reached a point in her career where she truly has nothing left to prove. That is true, Michael, but Charlotte defines herself. Lock it in, the Dragon Sleeper! 
showing the world just how much fight she's got left. Placing them into the corner. Running hip attack. What impact. Impressive reversal there. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Charlotte a step ahead there. These two showing how well scouted they each are. Big time move coming up. Up top. Dangerous predicament here. Not quite sure what they're planning. Oh, I think I know what they're planning. Spanish fly from the top. Huge. You've got to be impressed by the power possessed by Natalia. Sit out, power bomb. Two. Fence off the three count. Wow. Natalia getting excited. What's she going to do? Struggling a bit to stay afloat there. That unfolded just as Charlotte planned, showing she's not just brawn, she's brains too. Into a double knee drop. Is it enough? Two! No! Kicks out! She is still fighting, still keeping this going. Bang! Caught under the jaw with that. Position with the desperation jawbreaker, a stalemate of counters. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Oh! Ooh, bullseye! Things not going how she'd like. Look like Charlotte was uncorked with that attack. Connects on the kick. She's got to be. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. Oh, Charlotte waylays her. A handstand into a double knee drop. Momentum is clearly against Natalya now. Natalya needs... Uh-oh, Dragon Sleeper applied. This could be it. Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Setting up for something here. Prepare your face for that. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Counter! And now there's an opening. Oh, goodness, that was bad. Boom! Uh-oh. Look at this. Look at that. Torque of the leg. Oh, the leg breaker. That could have gone either way. Torturous focus on the leg in a corner. That kind of focused attack on the leg could provide dividends. Caught with that sharp elbow. 
These two having an answer for it. Nasty chop delivered by Charlotte. Oh, natural selection by Charlotte. The Queen has this round. Shoulders up, shoulders up. Oh, that was more than close. That was inches away from three. Millimeters. And Charlotte will have to go back to the drawing board and try and get things back where she wants them. Shin breaker. Oh, ouch. Evading offense. Charlotte with the spear. Oh, he got the shoulders down. What a win. Charlotte with the victory. Here is your winner, Charlotte Flair. The queen claims her throne as Charlotte Flair defeats Natalia. Genetic superiority on display, gentlemen. The animal has arrived. The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C. Weighing in at 290 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, the We can list this man's accolades all day long. WWE Champion, a Royal Rumble winner, a man who has main evented WrestleMania, and now Batista simply demands that the WWE Universe give him what he wants. Unparalleled success, both in the ring and in Hollywood, which is insane because for some reason, the WWE Universe has never appreciated Batista quite enough. Well, no question about it. Batista will demand the respect of the WWE Universe right here tonight.
Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And his opponent from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 225 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Chris Eric O. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. It's this simple for the champ. Win no matter what the stakes are. And with the bell, Batista is ready for action here. And Batista looks as imposing as ever. An absolute physical specimen. His predatory animal instinct only amplifies the fear that his opponent must be feeling right now. And we all know that Batista loves the thrill of the hunt. And somehow, this competitor has managed to convince WWE officials into getting a match against the champion. Oh, come on, Corey. It's a non-title match. We've seen what he's capable of, and I think this match is well-earned. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Wow, nice takedown. Oh, he fights Batista back. Gets him with the counter. Look at this, going counter for counter. Batista's aggression has always defined him in the ring. How does he keep it from getting the better of him? The animal cannot get carried away. Hold on a second, could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Oh, he gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. Gets slammed down. He was waiting for him to make his move. Oh, my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Now he's been put on the defensive. Batista wanted to go hunting. Well, he is now. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Pulled in from belly to belly. <laughs> belly to belly. Vicious. Nice takedown. And he goes for the pin. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. Boston. Oh, he's able to find enough grip to fight out of the hole. Crucial escape here. Got him set up. This could be it, Corey. Batista ball. Batista got all of him. He's going for the pin. This they could be it. it. Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. He's taking some serious hurt, but somehow he's still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure instinct alone. Not many people escape defeat after Batista gets hold of you and executes that maneuver. Sky high. Was ready for that. That misstep could have cost them this match entirely. A hard landing for sure. Turning the table 
Rolls there. in the Boston Crab. Can you imagine what it would do to his... And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Stop it! Will it be? It's over! It is over! Here is your winner! Chris Eric O! Batista falls short of success, taking a loss here in this one. Pretty shocking to see the animal get tamed like this. A tough loss for Batista. I actually like this because the trash talking's already started. It is very clear these superstars do not like each other. Oh, we're not going to wait any longer. The match hasn't even started yet. And these superstars couldn't care less. This is personal. These two just want to tear each other apart. I'm not sure the referee is going to get control. Emotions running high in this highly anticipated match, but this is officially underway. But should we? Unbelievable athleticism <laughs> into the armbar. Scorns his way out. Big cross body. He got whipped into that corner. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. German suplex released. Chop. Paying it right back with a reversal. So agile. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Watch these strikes. So precise. Oh, we're going to see more. Tiger faint kick, too. And he gets the better of HBK. Uh-oh. And a carefully measured knee drop. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. We're going to finish it off. Oh, a huge miss there. Vicious right forearm. Scouted. Michaels has to show his resilience after taking that maneuver. Throughout Michaels' career, he's demonstrated he's not afraid to stand in the eye of the storm. Sometimes he is the storm. Corey, will HBK's bona fide mean streak be enough in this one? One of Shawn Michaels' greatest assets is his sense of rebellion and defiance. Once that attitude ignites HBK's mean streak, watch out. He'll stop at no lengths to have his hands raised. Outrageous athleticism on the hurricane. Agility like that. Easier said than done, gentlemen. No! The dive! It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Stomping! Ooh. Ouch! Tap! Tap! Ooh. Up and... Oh! Knee right to the spine! Just turn that around. 
Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count runs out. David. HBK with a vintage kip up, and here comes Mr. WrestleMania. A heartbreak kid. In the cover. Barely kicks out. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Relentless offense from Michaels. HBK exerting his offense. He's got him down. Is this it? He narrowly avoids the count. Just barely, but it counts. Trying their opponent's arm out. Oh, my goodness. Big boot. Hoist it up. Oh, attacked in the midsection. Wicked clothesline into the cover. And they kick out at two. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Oh, man. Good golly, what a knee. HBK tuning up the bed. Sweet chant music. Michaels with the exclamation point. Try and end it. And he fights it off. This is going to come down to who wants it more. He manages to escape it. Nasty hit on the face. He has to be at his limit now. Maybe just stay down, man. You've done enough. And Michaels tattoos him with a... He may get the three count right here. I think so. Oh, he got him on a win. Here is your winner. The Heartbreak Kid. Talk about a solid win. Everything went their way here. Only because the opposition got softened up by that attack earlier. But you're right. Victory is theirs. This match was barely fair, if at all. They more or less stole this victory. At the end of the day, the how and the why doesn't matter, Saxton. All that matters now is they got the win.